how does the scrum master handles some of the organization's impediments? This question I got over the email and the person got this particular question in the interview. Many times the scrum masters are expected to take care of organization levels issues and impediments. Now, what do I do? I may have a limited power. I may be only focusing on a one scrum space and my organization may have a traditional mindset. So it all depends upon what kind of culture you work in and what kind of impediments you deal with. There could be many types of impediments and you may not be able to apply a one universal technique for it. But from my side, there are some ideas which might be useful in generically speaking in most of the impediments which you handle at an organization level. So what do I do as a leader, be it a scrum master or a project manager, when I face issues which are beyond my control, but they are slowing my delivery team, they are creating a problems in my overall value delivery. First thing, I recognize them. I make them visible. Transparency is an idea which is also promoted in the Agile world. The Scrum talks about transparency a lot. In a project management space also, before we do anything, we need to make the thing visible. So my recommendation is the issue impediments which you are facing, you need to have a clear visualization or showing of it to the appropriate stakeholders. So I may bring some information radiator, I may have some kind of issue log in case a project management space or something where these impediments are not hidden. So what I do, I expose the impediments. I make them clearly visible. I show how these things are impacting the project delivery. I show the impact they are making on our team, on our customer segment, on overall productivity and quality of our work. So this I should be able to do as a team leader, as a scrum master or a project manager, because these are the things which are in front of me. I should be able to make them visible. Now, what do I do next? How do I make more impact of it? After making these things visible, I do more and more detailed impact analysis on it. And I use the business language when I do impact analysis. So rather than saying we have a critical issue pending, I need to talk about something which is in, in the business language or this particular issue is delaying our delivery by one month. I talk about the impact in the business language so that people really get attentive to it. The third thing which I should do, I need to talk to those stakeholders who are really getting impacted because of this impediment or an issue. Maybe not all stakeholders are worried about the delay in the delivery happening because of whatever reasons. There could be some stakeholders who may be less impacted, but there would be some set of stakeholders who really getting impacted because of your team getting problems. We need to talk to those stakeholders more critically and show these impediments in the form of one-to-one -one meetings and ask their support for that area so that they can support you and you can get the delivery done. They will support you because you your problem indirectly is their problem as well. So I need to do a proper stakeholder identification and work with those stakeholders who are expected to getting impacted more in order to get away from these impediments. The another possibility, I can work with my other project management community of practice groups. So you may have a PMO or something. Your process related impediments, it depends upon the nature of work, may be handled with the help of community support. So I also look for my fellow scrum masters, my fellow project manager, my fellow leaders who can probably support me in the form of some discussion forum, in the form of some suggestions, which can help us in moving forward. So that's the another idea which I can do related to the impediments. In general, it's all about making things visible, showing the impact, keep showing that impact on a regular basis, working with appropriate stakeholders who can help you in getting things done, taking assistance from your team, rather than owning everything yourself, you make this thing issue, this impediment visible and seek help from your surrounding environment.